What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Sword and Shield. The Isles of Armor is now out as of, as of today, actually. And I'm finally off work, so I now get to actually play the freaking game how I want to play the game. I was having audio issues earlier. I was going to continue on Sword, since that's initially what I did the initial playthrough with. But being that the game audio didn't require, I didn't want to just keep playing while you guys are just hearing my voice and no sound. That's like... A whole experience to this so I ended up playing like an hour of the expansion on sword and luckily I haven't done anything on shield so I was like you know what I'll just play on my shield file uh, this one I actually have with like my name on it not just blades instead so that's just gonna be like the only thing to really adjust to is just the name difference uh, I have shinies on this one and I also have battle ready shinies so don't be surprised when you see my level 100 yada yada yadas that are shiny. Everybody has them nowadays. But yep, we got the armor pass. So it says go to Wedgehurst. And then we got our armor pass in our key pocket. I need to see what Pokemon are on the team. Okay, so this is like one of the teams I was battling with uh, pretty frequently actually. And I I think I'm a I think I'm a stick with that. Uh I'm probably just gonna start off with Seismitoad. Uh, Seismitoad is like slowly but surely becoming one of like my favorite Pokemon to actually like play with competitively. I know it can get wiped out by a lot of stuff, but that's fine with me. Oh, that's an armor pass. With that pass, you can go to the Isles of Armor. Where would you like to go today? The armor station, my friend. Take me away. Yeah, I'm so excited this is out and I'm off work. I was trying to record stuff during lunch and was hoping I'd have enough done at lunchtime, but like I said, I had audio issues when recording Sword for some reason. I don't know. I ended up just remaking a whole new scene on OBS for this. Is this your first visit to the Isles of Armor? I'm researching Pokemon biology here on this island. You want to register the Pokemon you catch on this island to your Pokedex, right? I'll update your Pokedex so you can do just that. Appreciates it be. So now we got the Isle of Armor Pokedex. And one thing a lot of people uh, were mentioning earlier was that when you upgrade, uh, or not when you upgrade, when you transfer Pokemon from home over to your save file, for some reason it's not counting in the Isle's Armor Pokedex. I don't know if that's just a bug for some people or they're just BSing on it. But just know for now that might be an issue. When you caught a lot of Pokemon in the Isles of Armor, come back and show me your Pokédex. Ma'am, yes ma'am. What's good, buddy? I'm supposed to join the Jojo on this time of day, but there's a strange person standing at the station and I'm a bit scared to head out. <sighs> oh. <laughs> He's out here like, squad, squad, hmm. You're the traveler, I suppose, the guide? Am I right? Exactly when we agreed to meet, too. Quite the commendable punctuality. Hmm. I've got the strangest feeling we've met before, but I can't recall. And here I thought amnesia was slowpoke's move. <laughs> My name is Avery. I'm a senior member of the dojo you are to join. I think you got the wrong person. You're here to join the master dojo, are you not? I also trained there. My goodness, this is a thick one. Like a poor lost Wulu. It's up to me as an elegant adult to make sure they get the message. Perhaps a show of strength is the best way to get to know each other. I'll await you outside. Once you're ready, come out to face me. Okay. Time to show him who the better trainer is. Okay, you don't gotta be a butthead about it. <laughs> whoop whoop, we out here. I love how my characters dress too. I think this is like my go-to song. I wish it was, uh, I wish it was like purple and blue. I don't know, I feel like that would be nice together. Hmm, is this your first visit to the Isles of Armor? 
You would no doubt like to run around and explore freely, but first let's make sure you can handle yourself. Naturally, as a member of the Master Dojo, I'll be using my psychic powers to test your strength. Come now, don't overexert yourself. I like how he's like, oh yeah, being that I'm at the dojo, I use psychic types. Like, bro, what? <laughs> you are challenged by- I like that animation. Now, like, I want to be a psychic trainer and use psychic- Abra? Okay. Here's my Seismitoad. <laughs> I'll show you what true power looks like. Uh, well, alrighty. beat the crap out of you. So I'll most likely be taking Umbreon, Hippowdon, and Rotom off the team uh, to showcase other Pokemon. When, when did I get beat down to my last Pokemon? Did you use Hypnosis on me? <laughs> nah, bro. Just Earthquake. We out here. And look at that. Power... Isn't, uh, isn't super effective because it's just a psychic test. I don't know, has Slowpoke always just been psychic? I thought Slowpokes were like psychic water, but maybe I guess Galarian versions are just psychic, so. Bug, Dark, Ghost. Such strength! I'm in Psy Shock! I might just switch. Um, I think I caught a Slowpoke. I, th I might switch that on. Ah, um, could could you give me a moment? Improbable. No, impossible. What kind of trick did this kid use? If a trainer of this talent arrives at the dojo, then the people there very well may suffer amnesia about my very existence. If only I could get rid of him. But I've been tasked with escorting him to the dojo. Ahem. <clears throat> you have potential. Why, you made me use a whole 3% of my strength. Still, how shall I put this? Our dojo is a respected place where even the famous champion Leon trained. What I'm trying to say is I don't think you're quite up to snuff. Therefore, I suggest you ignore the master dojo standing over there and head home as soon as you're done seeing the sights. I suppose you can have this too as a parting gift. And we just got a style card. So with the style card, we can now uh, increase what we can select in the boutiques and hair salons. Show it when you next visit the Patiko Hair Salon, and I'm sure you'll be able to find some more elegant garb like mine. Now then, farewell. I doubt I'll see you again. Every teleport. I'm not gonna lie. After playing Sword, uh, and getting through like this intro, I, ooh, Galer Galerica Twig. I will definitely say that I'm already enjoying this guy way more. <laughs> I'm trying to see if I can find that slowpoke. Disregard like all the eggs here, guys. I was on a hatching spree for certain shinies. There we go. Aw, uh, he's not that good, but that's fine. You're you're here just just to be a part of the squad. Um, I think I'll take. Nah, Age of Slash was also shiny. Umbreon and Age of Slash are my first two shinies I hatched on this uh, save file. So, um, ooh, Baneary. Rock Rough. Wolf Wolf out of here, my guy. So, you can actually catch Abras over here. Um, there's gonna be an Abra and a Chansey that pop up in the overall spawn. And the Abras actually will be teleporting around in like the grass. I don't know if there's like a certain time or weather for it. But, at least on Sword, I, that's what I was seeing. So now we're going to move on up. Oh, yep, there was Abra on the left. But, cutscene. Dig. Dig, dig. And it's the Alolan Diglett. Oh, Diglett, you're here. Haha, -ha, you little rascal. I was worried about you. Thank you for finding my Diglett. Is it from Alola? Oh, I didn't expect to meet someone who knows about it. <laughs> Sir, I play all the games. <laughs> That's right, this is a Diglett from the Alola region. When I traveled in Alola, I fell in love with these adorable three hairs. I caught a lot of Diglett there and came back. But they went somewhere when I looked away for a second. 
Anyway, you found a diglet buried in the ground? You definitely have a talent for finding diglets. If it's okay, will you find all the other diglets too? Uh, sure. Oh, what a kind person you are. Words can express how grateful I am. You found one diglet so far, so please find 150 more diglets. Yes, guys, he says 150. If you find them, please tell them to come back to me. Yep, because they, they definitely are just going to come back knowing exactly what I'm talking about. So, 150 diglets, they're strange. They're going to be in like various places over here. Uh, I guess right now, I just want to... Okay, yeah, I definitely need more watts. I wanted to see how many watts I had. I thought there was an item over here. Oh, nope, it was just a diglet. And there was a Lopini there. So there's 17 more in like this this open area it seems. I haven't caught them all but in this area when I played I just did it like very briefly. Got through like a couple of the cutscenes. Oh fiddlesticks, so our new student decided to go back home? It would appear so. I'll have you know my offer to escort them was perfect. He rather abruptly absconded after our battle. And I've been hoping to get a welcome the new member to our little family here too. Well, hello. And who are you, love? Hmm? <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> of course, you must be the new student that's supposed to join the dojo today. You got the wrong person. Yes, right, that's correct, ma'am. I swear, I thought you had used teleport or something. You disappeared so quickly. Regardless, it gives me great joy to know that you decided to come after all. <laughs> you slimy, shady person, Avery. Oh, everything's just coming up roses. Everything's just coming up ro I don't know, that sounds so weird to me. Now, I'm quite sure they already told me your name, but... the uh, There we go. That's right. You're Marquis. Of course you are, love. Though I'm rather sure that's not the same I was told before. You definitely weren't. It's a unique name. <laughs> My name's Honey. I help keep this place running. You can consider me the lady of the house. Not that the Master Dojo is just any old house. But why? But what purpose is he here? My future sight must be off. I must think before Miss Honey figures out that I told an innocent little lie. Seems we've already met our Avery. Bit of an odd duck, but, but he's one of our own. He's training hard here at the Dojo so he can become a gym leader someday. I can trust the two of you to get along, right? <laughs> it's an honor to make your acquaintance. Oh dear me, but look at me. Here I am, making you stand around outside after you've come all this way. Come in, come in. Don't mind that faint stench of sweat. Sure. Now listen. If you dare breathe a word of what happened at the station to Miss Honey? Well, let's just say my psychic powers are very potent. Do I make myself clear? Alright, and I saw that item over here, so we're gonna go get this item. I think it's the uh, expert belt. Yep, expert belt. There's more items up there, but we can get into that later. Everybody have an announcement to make. We've got a new student joining us today. Please welcome Marquis. I'm sure you'll have a lot to teach him. Hiya! Welcome to the dojo! All their students are so good and hardworking. Everyone really gives it their all around here. Now, here's someone who's not listed in our database of students. Hello, sweetie pie. It's not usual for you to bother greeting a newcomer. This is Hyde, my darling only son. Are you some kind of outlier? Here, you should give this a try. And we got an EXP charm, okay. Ooh. So now we can get more EXP, but don't open it, okay? It's got tech I developed inside and I don't want you to go and ruin it. Uh, sir, yes sir. He's so good with his hands, always making something new. Such a clever boy. And that handsome gent in the back is my darling hubby and the very master of the master dojo. Hmm. 
Why, hello there. My name is Mustard. I'm rather good at Pokemon battles, you know. I'm pleased as cheese that you could join us. Uh, nice to meet you. <laughs> Such a polite student. You seem to be the hardworking type, too. Don't let him fool you into thinking he's just a silly old man. He's a real beast when he gets serious. Well, darling, I'll leave the rest up to you. <laughs> Yay! This is my favorite part. I want to see just how good you are. So why not have a battle with little old me? Just say the word when you're ready. Boy, we about to beat the bricks off your butt. <laughs> Yahoo! Are you ready for a battle? I like how they just make honey mustard. That's like the combination with their names. All right, let's get this show started. This is the best way to get to know new students. Squad. You are challenged by Dojo Master Mustard. Ho ho. Meon Foo. Yippee. Oh, I just can't wait to see you battle your heart out. Okay. So, they were saying that there was going to be some level balancing in the uh, expansion, so we wouldn't have to worry about our highly leveled uh, Pokemon. So, I'm kind of wondering when's that going to go into play. Oh shit! I can't wait to get a Shanks, guys. Like no lie, Shanks. I might, I might end up actually putting like a whole new team on here. And I, d I just have to get EXP candy so I can like boost everybody up to I guess 60. I think 60 would, is like the default level they expect you to be at. Uh, yeah, I would love to to have a Luxray on the team. Um, I, I chose grass as my starter. Ooh, super duper effective. I smell danger. I chose grass as my starter for sword and shield uh, for the playthrough and like my own personal playthrough. And um, when it comes to the new Pokemon over here, uh, it's going to be basically like the same situation where you're going to have to choose uh, some starters. But haha, I lost. You're pretty strong, aren't you? Hey, the, the newbie won. Master wasn't going all out, but that's still pretty impressive. Who is this kid anyway? They've called me the M-A-R to the Q to the U to the I-S-E. The way you battle really shows me how much you care about your Pokemon. Even if you've come because of a misunderstanding, as long as you have a will to learn, then you're welcome at the Master Dojo. <laughs> I think we all can help each other become stronger. I'm happy you've come to join us. So on that note, here's your dojo uniform. Sweet. I ain't gonna lie, I like how my hair looking. <laughs> with that on, you'll fit right in with the students of my master dojo. Hey, newbie. If you want to change or take a break, use that room over there. Gotcha. Oh, that was a polyrath. Now then. With Makla said now, the dojo's at max capacity. It's time to really start our training. You'll all be facing three trials. Th three trials? Wait, why is there a max capacity for the dojo? <laughs> and there's more. The person who completes the three trials will receive the secret armor of this dojo. Oh, it's a secret armor set? I want it. <laughs> That's the spirit. Now let me explain the first trial. Pardon me, master. I haven't received my uniform yet. I dare say it's unfair for only that child to get the uniform. Unequal even. I demand an item swap. Oh dear, do you really not have a uniform? My bad, my bad. That's an easy fix though. I have another uniform right here for you, Avery. Ha, huh. it does pay to complain sometimes. With your proper behind. Woo! <laughs> swiping no swiping. Didn't say it loud enough, bro. What in the world? Hey, my dojo uniform, it's gone missing. Hmm. That speed, was it really the slowpoke? I've never seen any slowpoke move so fast. How dare you, are you using trick? Return my dojo uniform immediately.
they dipping. Oh my, where do you think they think you're going? Oops. Guess I let them out their Pokeballs a little too soon. <laughs> Master, what's up with you, Slowpoke? This is my first trial, my students. <laughs> You've all got to chase after those fast Slowpoke, trained with care by little old me. But that's not all. You'll need to defeat them, too. And while you're at it, could you get Avery's Dojo uniform back? Oh, do we have to? Well, that's that. Do your best, you lot. They all dipping. Um, uh, we're gonna we're gonna leave these clothes on, just just for the heck of it. Alrighty, so let's head this way. Oh, if you have a bike, let me customize it. I'm the bike lady. Yep, customize please. And I want glistening black. And y'all 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 not gonna be ready for this. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. So now you get like this BMX biker style. And actually, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you guys what the what the white uh, looks like. If there's blue on it, oh, okay. I was hoping it would uh it would have like some blue color, but I guess it makes sense with the rotom bike. Uh, let's change. Oops, I meant to change it to black. Dang it, I keep clicking too fast. <laughs> Only thing I'm not sure about is what happens when we say I want to change like my outfit. Okay, so we'll just leave it as is. I, I think I like that design. But alright, we're tasked with uh, fighting those. Ooh. We're tasked with catching those slow posts or just fighting them. And there's one. <laughs> oh, it's a fast slow post. We'll see how fast. Because this is definitely a jolly seismic though. Oh wow, so I guess they automatically will outspeed everybody's Pokemon? That's, that's my assumption. Can we even catch these guys? I feel like we won't even be able to, to catch them just, just for the simple fact that it's, uh, it's Mustard's Slowpoke. But it shows up like that option that I caught her already, so I don't know. I guess I'll throw a Pokeball at the next one. Okay, we got Avery's jacket now. Can we talk about how great it looks over here too? Like, they really did a way better job with making the wild area look like a wild area. Yeah, I guess I'll, I'll see about throwing a, um, a a repeat ball at this one. If it'll let me. I think I have repeat balls. Nope, okay, I, I don't. Guess it's another, oh, yep, there we go. You can't catch it. Would have been clutch though, cause uh, this rain dance, I mean that just like helps my guy out. <laughs> This 
still be a good way just to tell uh, how to evolve the slowpoke because I don't know, do we have to have it hold a specific item in order for it to evolve after hitting a certain level? They like to add new like evolution mechanics to the game. I will say I appreciate that a lot. Oh, we got a Poke Doll from that. And a Serious Mint. Thought I saw a Pokemon I hadn't seen uh, on the island yet. What is... Ooh. I'm really just excited to see what's all where. Ground dark. Uh, is that Crocodile? I think that's Crocodile. Oh, look at that, a Diglett. What cave is this? It, it called it something cave? I'm probably where I shouldn't be. Oh, I actually found that Diglett on accident. I didn't even know that was going to be there. Actually, yeah, that's what I, I wanted to get the item. Oh, wow, there's even more dens down here. Okay, that's kind of cool. I haven't even been over here before. Dang, can I get this Diglett? There we go. Oh. Oh. Taunt? I wonder if I could put that on if I wanted to. Alright, let's let's head out of this cave. Um, I'm really hoping that I can get... Oh, wow. Uh, I'm really hoping I can get like an, an uh, Aeron in the game. I don't know if it's pronounced Aaron or, or Aaron, like iron, since it's supposed to be like a steel pun. But I'm hoping to add that to my team because uh, Gen 3 with having Aggron on my team was always very, very important to me. So now I'm thinking uh, I want, want it on this one too. Yeah, these slowpoke definitely got some speed on them. I need to look up what the Galarian slowpoke speed stat is now so I can see how to build it on a team. Oh, I used the wrong move. But at least we get some health. <laughs> speed you on the first turn or did psych slower speed i don't know i didn't know psych lowered speed like that but alrighty that was the third one so now we can now we can head back uh, let me just ride my little my little old bike you know my my bmx bike back to where it belongs so fields of honor is what that this area is called and those two that are standing out there one sells berries the other one sells um, food recipes or not recipes uh, food ingredients oh Marcus welcome back <laughs> you were you able to reclaim my uniform all by yourself yeah, here you go. Hmm. You have my thanks. Well mustered, Marquis. You cleared the first trial like it was nothing. Why, I think this is the first time since Leon that someone was able to handle all three fast po slowpoke on their own. The rest of you tried very hard too. You were able to catch up to the slowpoke, but I guess you couldn't defeat them. <sighs> Tell you what. Anyone who was able to catch up to a slowpoke at least once gets a pass. Marcus really outdid himself, so it's only fair everyone else gets another chance. Try to make a comeback, everybody. Oh, how generous. <laughs> Either way, I'm still out. Oh, that reminds me. Honey, where are those little ones? 
Oh, that's right, darling. I had nearly forgotten. Squirtle, Bulbasaur, come on in, sweeties. Ah, uh, yeah. We get to choose our Gigantamax uh, Kanto starter. So we already got Charmander from Leon. I'm assuming he got it from them. And that's why it's only these two left. I like how it's Drift and Vine. We always gonna go with the Drift, though. In Sword, I picked up Bulbasaur. So in Shield, I'm gonna pick up Squirtle and I'm gonna transfer Bulbasaur over. These are our sweet little Pokemon, Bulbasaur and Squirtle. We've all been taking care of them together, and I'd say they're more than a little curious about your strength as a trainer. Why don't you pick one to keep for yourself? You did succeed in the trial, after all. And just so you know, these two have been raised in a very special way. When they evolve, they'll be able to Gigantamax. They're like level five. I, oh, look how look how they both smile when you like walk near them. <laughs> all right, we're going with Squirtle. So you're going with our little Squirtle? It's great with water type moves. Let's go, Squirtle. When it feels threatened, it draws its limbs inside its shell and sprays water from its mouth. Let's go. Squirtle looks pleased as punch that you chose it. Remember that your new Pokemon will be able to Gigantamax once it has fully evolved. So be sure to raise it well. Dynamaxing, a mysterious phenomenon unique to the Pokemon Galar. And then there's Gigantamaxing, a very special way of Dynamaxing for very special Pokemon. Their moves change, of course, but their appearance change too. Speaking of Gigantamax, there's that secret recipe of the Master Dojo. Drinking it makes you gigantic and strong. I call it Max Super. I'd love to have a bowl of max soup full of max mushrooms right about now. It sure has been a while. And that's why your second trial shall be mushroom picking. Max mushrooms are the key to Gigantamaxing, and I'm tasking you with finding three. Max mushrooms are red with a spiral pattern. I'm pretty sure you, they grow in the dark, humid places. And with that, your next trial begins. I'm counting on you. Whoa. And don't you worry, Bulbasaur, I'll be sure to raise you with lots of love. I'll make you oh so strong. You'll never lose to that Squirtle. <laughs> okay, honey. Miss Sunny, if you want that Pokemon to learn new moves, you can leave that to me. Well, aren't you just the sweetest thing? That lovely lad is always so kind. Give him a bit of Armorite ore, and he'll teach your darling new Pokemon move. You should give it a try. So, Armorite. So, it's material that can only be, I guess picked up and bartered on this map uh yep so let's see what moves we can even like learn i, I want to know if we can put something on squirtle oh you can flip turn oh man flip turn flip tur that's gonna change up the game what is this <laughs> it gets the comment it's like you turn Okay, we put in flip turn on Squirtle. <laughs> I know it's I know it's not really going to be uh, like good physically wise, but I don't know. It would seem that I am fated not to accept your capabilities as of yet. I will obtain the max mushrooms first to claim victory with my own two hands. Okay, and guys, with that said, I'm in this video off here. Next video, we're gonna go complete trial two with getting those mushrooms. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. If you haven't joined the Discord server and you want to join the Discord server, it's filled with just myself, my friends, and we talk about various games. It doesn't have to be Pokemon related. If you play anything on Xbox, PlayStation, PC, Switch, whatever, join in. The link is in the description. If you haven't followed me yet on Twitter, please do. That's Epic Blades or Epic underscore Blades. Uh, on Twitter, I remade my twitter after getting it up to like a thousand followers and i rarely used it so i'm back now and that's another way to interact with you guys so if you want to interact with me just let me know follow join discord all that good stuff but stay sharp guys later